the course catalog. This is a work in progress. This uh, which was prioritized, uh, as you know, by the uh, product advisory group. And um, what we're working on uh, basically is the MVP for the learning catalog feature that we call course catalog. And uh, this in this first stage, what we're going to do is replacing the Mural LMS core course catalog uh, slash course if if this is enabled uh, we're only adding courses for now programs will be will be added later uh, and when we add programs it will become the learning catalog and um and it will be possible to configure it as, as the site home page and allow public access to the same way you configure it in the existing course catalog so this is basically the Foundation Stone and the MVP, and we will build all the catalog features on top of this. So the work on this started. This is a big uh, epic uh, that will be growing, and the uh, Espresso team in in Workplace is already working on these um, three issues at the same time. Uh, next slide, please, Adrian. On the same topic, we started working on on a proof of concept for the course co for the cover courses for programs. Which is something that we'll need to uh, to add, so we can add programs to the catalog. We thought that uh, we would like to explore this option uh, to simplify course uh, program allocation through course enrollment, and also the, to allow uh, discoverability of programs. So basically, the idea is that we'll have what we call a cover course for program. That is the course that is uh, created automatically when you configure it in a program. Uh, in a program, and this is the course that the user will see in the course catalog. So in the course catalog, we'll show uh, programs through this cover course. And this will also help to simplify uh, enrollment because uh, when we will basically synchronize the enrollment from this course to the program. Which means that any enrollment that works uh, actually in the courses uh, can be applied to programs also without the need to re implementing all these enrollment plugins at the program level. So uh, we are just exploring this option. This is not for the uh, course catalog MVP, but we need to explore how it will work so we can define, uh, so we can design the next release of the learning catalog, take this into account. But it's very likely that we'll take this uh, path. <clears throat> We implemented a proof of concept that it works as expected. So uh, looks like this is a great option. So we'll see. 